I got something to say Come on, listen to me We're living our lives drug free yeah. Oh yeah It's Red Ribbon Week! We're the Red Ribbon Crew, and we're proud to be drug-free. Does everyone here know what Red Ribbon Week is? Red Ribbon Week is a celebration that happens every year during the last week in October. Millions of kids, teenagers, and adults in the United States and around the world wear red ribbons to display to their friends and family to show them all that they are committed to living a life that is free of drugs. You should have been given a red ribbon of your own to wear at this Red Ribbon Rally. Wear yours to school. At your grandma's house. While making your latest viral video. When playing video games with your friends. And at any other place, you want people to know that you believe in living a life free of drugs and alcohol. Here's how Red Ribbon Week got started. Like many hugely positive things, Red Ribbon Week grew out of something profoundly negative. On February 7, 1985, Enrique Kiki Camarena had been kidnapped by drug dealers, never to be seen alive again. For his kidnappers, their story was to end there. However, for his family, friends, and a grateful nation, it was only the beginning. They pledged not to let his legacy fade and his sacrifice be in vain. Across the country, citizens wore and displayed red ribbon. I wear my red ribbon every day. Not only in memory of Special Agent Camarena, but for all those whose lives were lost trying to free the nation from drugs. Beyond that, the red ribbon symbolized the development of an attitude of intolerance regarding the use of drugs. There is nothing admirable, positive, or socially desirable about it. There is nothing desirable about drugs. They're bad. In a 1988 proclamation, Congress established Red Ribbon Week to commemorate the work and life of Kiki and to show intolerance for drugs in our schools, workplaces, and communities. DEA celebrates Red Ribbon Week with hundreds of other activities, including 5K runs and walks, drug-free carnivals, decorating contests, poster contests, and rap and poetry contests. Live your life the drug-free way. Hold up your ribbon, let's celebrate. I'm drug-free, you're drug-free. Everybody celebrate with me. Move your ribbon from side to side. Let's celebrate our drug-free lives. Yeah. Hey, this is Red Ribbon Week. This week we celebrate. So come on and make me proud. Let's say the pledge out loud. I pledge to stay in school and learn the things that I need to know. I pledge to make the world a better place for kids like me to grow. I pledge to keep my dreams alive and be all that I can be. I pledge to help others and to keep myself drug free. Take a look what some of these kids do to stay drug free. I play baseball and I think that's very important. And education, that's very important. I sing, I act, I go on a lot of social media rants. I'm a very loud teenager. Love who you are as a person and not feel that you have to escape from what's real in life. My whole life right now revolves around performance and entertaining people, making people happy. Keep yourself busy, keep yourself motivated to want to do more than escaping to doing drugs to like, so you can have a fulfilled life. Thanks for joining us everyone. Oh yeah, and visit JustThinkTwice.com for information and stories about living a drug-free life. Have a great Red Ribbon Week! Parents can log on to DEA.gov for more information about preventing childhood drug addiction. I'm drunk.